This is your boy, C4 for show. And right now we got a special guest, goes by Mike Rich, coming all the way from the Oak Town, the Bay Area. One of the Bay Area's finest. Y'all might have seen him. He's real big on the party scene, on the club scene, on the promotion scene. So I'm just gonna let him introduce himself to you all guys real quick. Go and tell him a little something about yourself. Shot Town. Always been loved from the Bay to the Shy. What up? This is your man Mike Rich from the Bay Area. Double salute. Count on the chest. Much respect. Um, right here with my brother um, CB. Been knowing him a long time. I've been in the industry a long time. My hybrid, a lot of different things. Doing bodyguarding, security, regular little promotions, artist promotions, club promotions, tour management, artist management. Now I'm live and direct, having my folks actually live in flesh, not just over a cell phone, but in person, in your area. And tell them how they can reach you. Tell them your social media handle. Follow me on IG at them, heading off, and you'll find them all the information on there. Pretty much it's at, at M-E-T-I-G-O-F-F, -F. that's my IG, and then all my uh, Twitter, Facebook, everything is on my IG. Cool, cool, cool. And just to give the people a little insight, actually me and Mike, we became good friends during the hyphy movement. And the hyphy movement Absolutely. was a whole wave. So let's just let the people know firsthand what the hyphy movement was about. Ooh we. It's kind of like when, you know, y'all got your whole different um, sides out here in the shy and y'all be going crazy. Much respect. Barry, it's the same with the hyphy movement. It was, it was a big deal. You know, when you say hyphy, you think of people going crazy in a positive way, changing the culture. Because before the hyphy movement, people were just wearing suits and ties and, and dress shoes to the club. And when the hyphy movement came, people were like, you know what? More than white tee, blue jeans at night, shout out to the brother Keith the Sneak. And then shout out Keith. Make it feel like, okay, this is what it is. We're out here, I understand your culture is like somewhat similar, like people that wearing hoodies in the club, because that's your culture. And like I said, like I said much respect and that's the beauty of the shy and he also in the beauty of the bay and i'm here in the shy most definitely and also uh we have a common connection because i have some family that he went to school with in richmond and for the people who don't know they don't understand that oakland the bay northern california is a big place they all think it just consists of oakland east oakland but they don't understand about richmond let them know about richmond california Richmond is a connection of San Francisco and Oakland in terms of how it's all mixed in. You got people that got cousins from, someone could be from Hunters Point, the projects in San Francisco, and have a cousin from Richmond and be connected. And they could have a relative from Oakland, East or West Oakland, and be connected. Either way, it's all Bay Love. You know, all connected, all off of one, just like out here in your beautiful city. It's just uh, make, trying to make it happen, you know, by any way, any means, you know, just uh, surviving to the, um, this thing called life. Most definitely, most definitely. And also, as far as the Bay Area DJs with Camiel, let them know about Big Vaughn, Rick Lee. Let them know about the DJ. Shout out to my brothers, Big Vaughn, and my guy, DJ Rick Lee. Always hold it down. They've been in the industry for a long time. Vaughn's done up work out here multiple times throughout his career with uh, Moss Def and Black Star. Hold it down. The different DJs, the different artists he's worked with in New York and he's been out to the shy a few times to handle business. Uh, my DJ Rick Lee, I'm gonna get him out here soon. You know he's gonna experience the shy. He's gonna get on some gigs out here. You know we're gonna make it happen. Other than that, um, catch me tomorrow at the Barrier Sports Spectacular. Meeting, there's over 80 athletes. They had it today, tomorrow, and Sunday. I will only be here due to time constraints from my schedule. I'll only be here for the Saturday session. If you want to meet in person, tap in, exchange numbers, take some flicks, network, kick it. I'll be out there tomorrow during the day to meet some athletes, hang out, network. I will be there at the George E. Stevenson Convention Center out here in the outskirts of Shy, the Wizard. Rosemont. Rosemont. Sorry, y'all. Uh, Rosemont, Illinois. My apologies. I ain't from here, but I respect you all over here. <laughs> also, just so you know, fun fact. My real name is Michael. So growing up, I was also a Bulls fan and a Warriors fan. You guys, anyone that knows me, my two favorite teams, even to this day, my two favorite teams in the history of basketball, not just the NBA, but basketball period, are the Chicago Bulls and the Golden State Warriors. And since we're talking about basketball, much respect. One of my favorite movies of all time, Heaven is a Playground. Shout out to Cabrini Green and all the people that have come from Cabrini Green's 
Outdoor courts and what they've done. Double salute. Pat on the chest. Prayers with respect. I see you. I appreciate you. I got love for you. Thank you. I'm um, shout out to the Hoop Dreams. Shout out to Patrick Beverly and all the wonderful people that made it out of here. Eddie Curry. The list was on on. On the Shy Town Legends. Uh, Billy the Kid Harris, rest in peace. Much respect. Thank you. Thank you. And Mo yes. Most definitely, y'all. And yeah, Mike, this is Mike's first time to the Shy Town. And yes. I'm definitely going to let him see the city. We're going to take him downtown. And I want to say, I love it. It is beautiful out here. Because this, this is where it's at. A lot of people get a misconception because they go by what the news report about as far as with all the crime and the drill, but they don't understand Chicago is the third biggest city in the country, which means we have a lot of areas. Everything is not the ghetto. Everything is not the inner city. We have a beautiful downtown. We got a lot of attractions. We got a lot of food. And I'm gonna let my man know that we got it going on. And before I leave, I wanna say RP to Fredo Santana, RP to King Vaughn. Uh, salute to Chief Keith and salute to Blow Dirt and his whole crew for holding down Chicago noise and music scene. Much love, much respect.